On an April night in 2003, five security guards began their shift at a quiet science laboratory. None of them would live to see the morning. All of them shot, decapitated, eviscerated. And now, over 15 years later, the perpetrators are being brought to justice. Stephen Fry. Steve, we're screwed. I'm very unqualified. Biff Feedback and Mario Stradivarius, you are charged with the murder of five men. How do you plead? Five? We slaughtered more than that. Shut up, Biff. We plead not guilty. Let the trial begin. Mr. Jingles, you may begin your prosecution. Thank you, Your Honor. Members of the jury, I will prove to you that these two filthy perverts gleefully butchered five innocent men on the night of April 15th. Objection. It was April 16th. In your face, monkey dude. Quite so. The butchering took place on the 16th. The evidence will show... Your Honor, please instruct the defendant to stop tempting me with bananas. Stop it, Mr. Feedback. Douche. What was that? I said, touche. Continue, Mr. Jingles. The evidence will show that the godless perverts sitting here smiled while they slaughtered five Christian men. Thank you. Mr. Stradivarius, you may give your opening remarks. Thank you, Judge Fryam. Guten Tag, meine Damen und Herren. Biff and I may be filthy perverts, and we do not believe in your silly god. And we did enjoy watching crimson rivers of blood spurt from the holes we made in those men. But is that really a good reason to fine us $100? I think not. The penalty you are facing, Mr. Stradivarius, is death by torture. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, as God is my witness, I have never seen that man before. And on the night of April 16th, I was teaching crippled children how to yodel. You lying fuckwad! Sit down, Mr. Stradivarius. Mr. Jingles, call your first witness. I call Gregory Henchman to the stand. Mr. Henchman, you are impaled on a spear, are you not? Yes, sir, I am. Does it hurt? Bloody right it hurts. And every time I sneeze, blood shoots out me bum. Who did this to you? That bloke with the helmet. Your witness. Henchman, dude, are you... Gay. Objection! Withdrawn. Mr. Henchman. Oh, sorry, dude. 
No more questions. Call your next witness, Mr. Jingles. I call Dr. X to the stand. Dr. X, what is your occupation? I am a mad scientist! On the night of April 16th, did you kidnap two people for the purpose of performing experiments upon them? Yes! They were to be tortured in my pleasure pain device until driven mad! And after they were driven mad, what would you have done with them? I would have let them go free. Let them go free. But what happened before you could let them go free? That Pilgarlic lunatic came in and slaughtered my janitorial crew! Your witness, Mr. Stradivarius. Dr. X, are you gay? Objection! No, I'll allow it. Again, are you gay, Dr. X? A little. <gasps> I was young, we were drunk! I was the pitcher, I swear! No further questions. Any more witnesses, Mr. Jingles? The prosecution rests, Your Honor. The prosecution smells, Your Honor. Shut up, Mr. Feedback. You may now call your witnesses. I call Biff Feedback to the stand. Mr. Feedback. When you shot the wounded guard in the head, reducing his skull to mere slivers of plastic, you were smiling. Yes, dude. I was. Were you smiling because you enjoyed the violence you were perpetrating? No. I was smiling because I was high on crack at the time. Thank you. No further questions. Your witness, Mr. Jingles. <laughs> Objection. The prosecution is badgering the witness. No, I'll allow this. Continue, Mr. Jingles. Now who smells, Mr. Feedback? No further questions. Any more witnesses? I call Jesus Christ to the stand. Hey, dude. I still feel dirty on the inside. Mr. Christ, which is the higher law, man's law or God's law? God's law is above all others. Yes, and according to God's law, if I were to commit a sin, say the slaughter of five or more men, should I be forgiven for such an act? If you accept me into your- A yes or no answer only, Mr. Christ. Yes. But only Thank if... you, that will do. Your witness, Chimpy. I am not a chimpanzee! I have a tail! Mr. Christ. Are you gay? Objection. Withdrawn. No further questions. Closing remarks, Mr. Jingles. Members of the jury, I am a simple monkey. I live in a tree and eat bananas all day. I don't know much, but I do know this. These two evil people killed five honest men in cold blood and must be found guilty. Thank you. Mr. Feedback, Mr. Stradivarius, you may give your closing statements. Dudes and dudettes, this is all like fake news invented by the uh, deep state liberal media. And uh, even if we did it, Obama-era laws forced us to because we're not gay. Thanks. Yes, and if convicted, please pardon us, Mr. President. Aren't you immigrants from Mongolia? Yeah. Fake news. I mean, yeah, fake news. How does it feel to be found not guilty? It's great, dude. I can't believe it. How did it happen? Well, Mr. Jingles was actually Dr. X's pet monkey and not a prosecuting attorney. He dropped out of law school after only two years. What happened when the judge found out? Dr. X was arrested. 
But then he escaped. He vowed to hunt you and I down and kill us. Whatever. Let's go get some bagels. And tacos. <laughs> turns and smiles at the camera, right? Or farts, maybe? I